What up, in this John Shabo IBS Kelso coming back with another MX Bikes banger. Now, before you adjust your phone brightness or change your monitor settings, yes, I am black from playing a dirt bike game. And today we're here at uh, Aiden's K Bell Racing Series. This is round one, uh, Portland. And uh, it just started today, well, yesterday for you guys that are watching the video, but it just started on this Friday. Um, this is round one, Portland. And I gotta say, man, it was an absolute amazing time for me to be able to try to qualify and all this. And I won't, I won't promise you, I will not spoil this video. I really want you guys to look into this. This is absolutely insane. Um, stick to the end of the video, like, and subscribe. I do appreciate it. Um, but with that being said, man, hopefully you guys get into this. The link will be down in the description below to their Discord. That way you guys can know when their next one's uh, happening. I believe it's gonna be every Friday. Don't quote me, though. Um, but yeah, uh, my progress uh, was absolutely immaculate in this video. So sorry, I'm trying to talk and and ride at the same time. This track just came out, and it's like the the post, not nah, the post of uh, what what apocalypse. So yeah, with that being said, man, I can't thank you guys enough for the support. Uh, Four thousand subs, hopefully. And uh, yeah, we're just gonna keep cooking. But I want to see this unravel. My camera will be on the ex the whole time. That way, you guys get to see me go through the frustration, and you guys get to live it through the happiness, the uh, bad times, the good times, and just see how I was looking and uh, feeling throughout this whole thing. So yeah, without further ado, uh, shout out to my boy Zalador. He really did help a lot during this uh, whole thing. So. Uh, he doesn't have any socials to tag in, so that's cool with me, man. I'm sorry, but yeah, a huge guy. He did make the 450 main, but I, I gotta say, man, hopefully you guys stick to the end of the video. I won't talk your ears off anymore. Let's get right into it. So, yeah, boom. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Alright, so right out of the gate, dude, literally, as uh, qualifying started, man, I put down, like, two, like, heaters. Like, I'm not even say they're, like, they're, they're, they're like, you know pro heaters but i'm saying for me man i i've never seen myself be so freaking consistent um i think the biggest thing that that hit me and will continue to hinder me hinder me for now is uh trying to get through these whoops with like absolute prestige um i would say for this first first like lap thing i was just trying to set down a uh, you know a lap to go off of um so i was messing up a little bit but like it was the fact that i was able to hold it and went crazy so this is like insane now i knew a triple in here to a quad quad would be super hard for some reason i th i saw people doing it but then i also heard that this wasn't the line um but you had to be precise in order to hit some of these lines and i felt like sometimes i was being precise and in others i was getting too carried away um, but that huge transfer into there to get into these doubles is crazy. And then I think if you were to rail this completely, you can get the full triple out off that before that table. Um, I knew the 450s had did it. I had hosted a video. Uh, I had hosted a server right before, like as like the hour was coming in. And I gotta say, homie just went a little crazy on me. Like for instance, what I mean crazy is Aiden came through and did that line, and no one knew about it. And then like he literally exposed it right then and there. So um, yeah, with that being said, everybody started using that, and that was a really good time for 450s. I wish I would have used it for a 250, but yeah, I just don't think I had the beans or I had I have the skill yet to do it. But right off the bat, I run like a really good lap, and I'm like, okay, bet. Like I think I was 121. I don't even know, but I was right on top of uh, the leaderboard. Uh, you know the standing so i'm like let's go for another one like i'm not i'm cruising and i've realized that i was actually cutting down on this which is a really good thing you can really cut down and um use that to the best of your ability you could either do that or triple in either one works uh, i didn't think either or was wrong i did end up doing the triple uh in and i ended up getting a faster time than what i ran here but it was only like maybe so i think it was maybe 0.4 uh seconds faster so really now all it is is i wasn't really scrubbing I should say like i was scrubbing but i wasn't you know like like i wasn't scrubbing hard so um yeah that that was the thing that turned away from you know setting faster laps when these people were literally scrubbing the like life out of every jump and it's just like man like i'm still learning to scrub which is fine i'm like i said like i'm i'm okay understanding like where i need to be i'm just happy like with the progress i've seen like literally from two weeks ago to now i'm literally being able to get around a whole track and try to set burners without falling over and over and over. So yeah, that's like straight two right out the gate, man. All right, so we go out the gate again, or it's about like 10 minutes in now, almost eight minutes. Um, server dies. I'm running a 120.5, right? So I have some time to still kill and I'm trying to practice and I'm actually, you know, feeling it. Like I'm like, okay, you know, like I keep practicing, I keep messing up, okay. Um, then I realized at that point I was like, yes, yeah, something's not adding up. So around eight minutes we ended up server crashing, which was fine. Uh, server ended up crashing, which was fine, and then bada bang, bada boom, you know, 
Bob's your uncle. We had to wait for the server to get back up. All right, so Aiden was happy enough to give us another five minute practice with 10 minutes worth of qualifying, which was fine with us. Um, kind of, you know, I'm, I'm already flustered. I'm like, man, so we got to do another five practice and I'm messing up. I'm getting a little crazy because it's like, man, I already had the groove, right? So I, I, I didn't want to show all of this practice because it was actually not necessarily terrifying or bad, I should say. But man, it took me a very long time to just put back the heater I was trying to get because I felt like I was just trying to rush it and then try to find faster lines. Um, but we were actually able to do pretty okay uh, for myself. And I got to say, we were able to run a 120.1 um i'm gonna show you the qualifying times right now um i came 13th place for lcq uh with a 120 cutoff was literally at a 118 guys guy ran like a 115 on a 250 so these guys were literally it all came down to just scrubbing harder than anybody else so at that point you got to just understand like these guys are literally on 10 and they've been practicing and i realized at this point i was really going against people that are practicing and trying to qualify for pros this year so it's huge to know that like you know like i'm in the same percentile maybe not in the pro scene i didn't get to qualify there but being able to kind of like get to the lcq and be 13th and be able to actually have a qualifying lap is huge like it's huge for my amateur times coming up here soon so very excited um yeah like i said i i i'm running all these laps right now and it just didn't really matter so yeah let's get right into the race all right i can't fault anybody else other than myself here uh yeah my my start kind of just got a little crazy and also this gate dropped really quick but hopefully you guys stick to the end of the video and you guys made it this far like and subscribe Peace.
Uh. Oh, okay. <laughs> My bad, pimp. All right, so this right here, I really don't fault X Crew, but this is Kawasaki things on ten, bro. A chicken bone, bro. Now, once again, this right here is just almost like front tuck galore, whether it's either him or the Kawasaki, but man, is my boy X putting a bad name on this bike right now, man. Oh, man. I like I was on a good charge and then I just messed up. <sighs> ah, another tough blocky. Fair enough. 